One of the best features about the iPhone 4 is its addition of the gyroscope, an element that gives new definition and motion sensitivity. And some apps are starting to catch on to this awesome asset, but none exemplify what it can do quite like GyroDraw. Let's check it out. So GyroDraw is essentially what it sounds like. You use motion to create your pictures, and you can either use the gyroscope or the accelerometer. So to demonstrate, here's the gyroscope on a selection of paper. And it basically senses the gravity to draw and uses the wherever you're rotating the device to create the picture. But unlike the accelerometer, it is not sensitive to the acceleration. Once you lift up your finger from drawing, you can access the main menu and either clear the image or save it to the photo library or go back to the main menu. Or you can um, change the color or thickness of the pencil or the speed of the gyroscope. And the accelerometer option works much in the same way, except that it uses the accelerometer. So it's much more sensitive and you know, really takes into the account the acceleration to create the image. So you really see a difference between the gyroscope and the, the accelerometer. GyroDraw is unlike any other drawing app out there and is really a great way to visualize the differences between the gyroscope and the accelerometer on the iPhone 4. And while it is, you know, a very simple app, I actually think that kind of works to its strengths because it helps highlight what the premise of the app is, namely noting that difference, um, while also, you know, giving you a fun way to work with the two kinds of uh, motion mechanisms. Um, however, I do think there are some details that could be added to the app. For instance, um, I think it would be great to also have a manual mode so, you know, while you're using the motion detectors to draw, you can also, you know, interject, you know, your, make something more specific. Um, and also, I think it would be cool to be able to switch modes within a specific drawing so that you can really see, you know, what how the differences manifest themselves. Um, and also, you know, the ability to revisit past projects would be cool, and also maybe even some social networking integration, just because that is so important nowadays. Um, but, and there were, there were a few kinks that need to be worked out in future updates, such as some minor freezing issues, and also, um, you know, it, it didn't function as accurately as I had hoped, but I have faith that the developers will address this. Um, but Overall, I really found um, GyroDraw to be a great, you know, novelty item. It's a free app. It's, you know, very unique and fun way to experience the gyroscope and the accelerometer. And really nothing exists like it at this point. So, you know, it's really a great way to utilize all the latest and greatest additions to the iPhone. And for more latest and greatest iPhone and iPad applications, visit iPhoneApplicationList.com.